Hello and welcome! Paul here, and this is Mountain Blade Warband. We're currently fighting the Nords at this castle, we're currently sieging it. I'm hoping to take this, and some point after we will make peace with the Nords, because the Rodox declared war upon us in the last video. That's not very good for us, so... But I'm hoping we can take this fairly quick. Normally I stop here and take out all the archers, I think I will. I was hoping we could get straight up here and out of the wall. Let's still see if I can do that, although there's a lot of them here. It's very deceptive looking. There we go, I'm in. Let's take out the archers up here. Play Overwatch for a little while. Let's see if I can hit him. I'm doing a horrible job here. What the bloody hell am I playing at? Okay, so they seem to be doing quite a number on us. They all coming for me. Alright, let's go put a stop to them, eh? I should have done this in the first place. So I'm the Phoenix King, that's who I am. business though. Him. Oh my god, some bloom! Okay, there we go. Oh, you... Ah, oh, that's okay, that's the enemy anyway. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's all the enemy. Yeah, come on then. Stay allowed. I'm getting nasty now, throwing stuff. Throwing pointy sticks at me. Let's see if any of my any of the enemies up here left some arrows. Any quivers up here? Nope, just swords. Maybe I can get my archers to retreat, bring in more folk. And do they retreat or do they charge? Nope, retreat appears to be the charge button, okay. Well, they're gonna get slaughtered. See the, I can't see to aim. Yeah, that ain't happening. Alright, I think my guys have got everything, so that's good. Why is it so bright here in the sky? I mean, 
That's a bit random. Okay. Well, we won anyway. Who cares? Bang up job, lads. Bang up job. There's no point me giving this castle to Bulba. The only thing that will get his relation up enough to make it worthwhile would be a castle. So, I mean, a not a castle, a city. But then again, how many cities are we actually going to be taking here soon? So, maybe I should. Bulba, quit your whining. Where are you? At least not number 15, that's good. AM's minus 6, Jesus. This is getting tricky. And I can't just get rid of them because they'll join another faction and they'll have the, the castles and the, the cities. You know, it's a bit of a pain. Now, while we're here, let me just check this castle. How many defenders? 95. Well, they don't seem to have many defenders here at all, so why don't we take it? And yeah, I need to make peace with them at some point, but I mean, if they're going to keep giving us easy places to attack, well, let's see if we can do this. I still need to go defend that city, I forgot about it, I should have done that first, but oh well. My goal at the moment is to take as much land as possible from the Nords, the next time they offer a peace treatment. They've already done it once, I rejected it though. But the next time they offer peace, I'll accept it. Then they can't take back any of the land we've just taken. Then we can focus our attention to the uh, Rodox. Because they're going to be the ones I need to watch out for. There. God, we're sending a lot of arrows up there. But they're the ones that seem to be getting all the kills at the moment, so I'm leaving them to it. See if I can get up there and make a difference. Off. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. I'm gonna get hit by some something thrown down here at this rate. Don't want to retreat, but maybe soon. I don't know. Unless we get more infantry to send up. He had a whole quiver and only got one arrow. What's up with that? I hate it that after a while they stopped dropping their arrows. See, I picked up another arrow, I've got nothing. I mean, what do I do? Should I just retreat for now and then heal up a little bit, restart the siege? Although we seem to, we appear to have the battlements, so maybe I should just push on this advantage. Oh wow, we can't get to you guys. That's a bit. Whoa, and oh right, they're down there. Oh, that was my fault. I should be paying attention. To be fair, I was about to pull out anyway. About the abandon. I was about to wait. 
heal up, and then re-siege. Yes, and they're going after all of our other stuff. But you know what, it's not a problem. It wasn't for the fact that I had to actually garrison every single castle, I'd just like take ownership of all castles just to stop any problem with my lords. Okay, let us rush forward at this slow walking space uh, pace. Not much we can do though, all I can hope is that our ranged put a heavy toll on the enemy again. I'm hoping the Nords has to make peace here at some point. When you're not wanting when you're not wanting peace, it pops up all the time, but when you actually want the peace treaty for the moment, uh, you'll never see it. Or it'll come too late. Because I believe if they're in the middle of a siege, that will carry on. And I'm not sure if you can defend it, I'll have to check. For the sake of science, that might be worth checking out. Seem to be doing an okay job at the moment. Yeah, man, but these Huskals, Nord veterans and warriors, they're pretty nasty defenders. Although I know I can beat them, I think the problem still is the. Uh oh no, no arrows. The biggest problem is still the enemy. Archers. Although these guys throw axes and whatnot and they do hurt. Bolts, bugger. We're at standstill now and we're getting getting hurt pretty badly, although it could be because I've just sent my archers up rather than waiting back. Bugger I didn't notice that. Did not notice that. And there's no point in me holding them back for me to go up because these lot all have secondary weapons to throw, so that's the biggest problem we've got. However, at least doing that, we're getting a fresh supply of cavalry and troops and all sorts, so it's not all doom and gloom. There we go. Our crossmen are in, crossbowmen are in position now. They're actually reaping havoc on the enemy, so that's good. Although they're blocking the ladder as well, that's not so good. Oh, and I was knocked out by a Huskar. That's fine, I was busy messing around trying to pick up some arrows and picked up a bow instead. Oh, typical. So they only have 18 defenders. Oh, in that case. <laughs> Besiege the castle. 18 defenders, I think we can handle that. I've got no health though, so I have to be bloody careful. I bet my troops have no morale at all. Look all the arrows going overhead. Glorious sight. Sadly I don't think they're hitting anything from all the way over there. I want the archers to hold this position. I better get back. I don't want to get hit by anything. I noticed that some of the Huskal throwing axes go invisible when they throw them. At least it's happened a couple of times. Make sure I'm not in line of sight for anyone. He's gonna, the guy's going to be too busy to throw anything, so maybe I can get in a better position to actually hit someone from the side here.
Bingo. And that just opened the floodgates. Archer up on the right. The ladder. Huskars are hurting us, man. Come on, what are you doing? Take him out. Okay, let's take out some of those archers. And the other archer, come on. Oh, nice. Very good, another castle back into the fold. Fantastic. I'm hoping that in Mountain Blade Bannerlord, you perhaps you have the option to design your own castle. That would be really nice. Or at least to set up like set up uh, defenses like walls and stuff or uh, like barricades. Hell, if I could just stand where I wanted my troops, that would be awesome. You know, I'd just have like a wall of archers ready. <laughs> then a shield wall at wherever they're going to reach. That would be nice. But um, we'll see what they deliver with Bannerlord, to be honest. And whatever doesn't get added, the modding community will surely make up for it. Okay, AM, where are you? I need to get him out of negative at least. He owns a lot though. Another castle, uh, city would probably do it. Okay, so we've took that back. Now I could probably take Kundar Castle there, but to be honest, I don't want to overstretch. You know, overstretch myself. I'm trying to defend stuff. I know. Well, I need to defend what I've been losing at the moment. So why don't we do that first? Scare him away from here, and then scare him away from Drag Dramug. Speaking of which, where the hell is Dramug Castle? There it is. There he is, go on. Have that y'all. Okay, so I might let him go if we do beat him. Pretty high up relation. But this should be a fairly uh, easy fight. You need a faster horse, or probably would help if I wasn't weighed down so much with all this armor. Oh well. I'm curious if this guy next to me gets a kill. Nope, oh, shattered a shield, that work. My, my, he's tough. Oh, Jesus. Two hits each. I thought he was an enemy, I thought he was a friendly. Waiting to hill to kill this guy. Okay, nice one. Let's mop up the remains now. I think we've broken them. Shattered his shield, that's pretty cool. That will work. 
Alright, so we didn't take many losses against this enemy. So that was pretty good. Although there's reinforcements, let's go take them out. Intercept. This enemy's tough though, I'll give them that. Oh, Lancers. Bloody careful. Oh, one. Well, I thought I had a bloody sword and shield. Okay, I need help, man. Where are my cavalry? Cavalry, movement orders, follow me. Get these guys off me. I'll do a bit of tricky riding here. Turn and face. I just need to stick a spike on the front of my horse, that way every time I head charge into someone I actually do something useful rather than stopping myself. I seem to be doing that an awful lot now. is he going to take? God. There we go. Okay, so I need to... Is Rivercheck under siege yet? I really need the enemy to just give me a peace treaty or should I send one of my, car one of my companions to offer them peace? I mean, I could probably keep taking castles since my war band still pretty my, well. My war party is still pretty big, but at the same time, I don't want to stretch myself too thin because we still need to counterattack the Rodox. Hmm, it's tricky indeed. Anyway, come on, who's left? We've been out here for ages fighting. Wrap it up. Battle won. <laughs> Battle not won. Can I order my troops to attack the enemy without me? Yeah, let's just finish it this way. There we go, that wasn't so bad. Take a few prisoners for the trip home. Leave them with the junk. Let mate rest upon the battlefield. Now, Rivercheck. That's not under siege, that's good. Dravenmug Castle is safe. R Ravidin is safe. So, I mean, I could probably take Cundin Castle up there. Maybe Alberk. But, to be honest, I've gotten a good chunk of land now and it's pretty well all hooked up. Yes, there's still the odd few spaces here, but to be honest, I've got the Rodox pushing in now and messing with me so I think I need to quit while I'm ahead as the saying goes so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna speak with where is he? where's my engineer? actually I can't do it from here so what we're going to have to do is go back to Dirim. So 
so I can dispatch an emissary. And hopefully we can make peace. I've got a few. Oh, I thought I could. I thought I saw him, Lord Atis. We'll deal with you soon. Okay, I need to make peace. Um, how do we do this? I don't think I've made peace yet with someone, apart from when they offer it to me. All right, we'll send Mafel because I believe she's an Nord. Okay, now all we have to do is wait. I mean, bunch of lords hit Hades. I can't believe it. Lord Gundar, he's back already. <laughs> Jeez, I was hoping to beat him around a little bit in the battlefield. I can't believe he's back. Oh my god, they must have had a rough time wherever they went. Although Atis has been gone for a long time. At least he knew to stay away. Alright, so all we can do now is wait and find out if we're going to make peace. So, I don't think it takes too long to be honest. Especially doesn't if you want to find out if you're king or not. Now, where should we hit next? If he declines the peace, then we'll be straight in there. We'll take these castles here. <laughs> I like that. Well, Angron, at last I found you. I have returned from my mission to the Kingdom of Nords. In general, I would say King Ragnar is alarmed by the growing power of Angron. Damn right. Oh, he's unwilling to conclude a peace. Okay, fair enough. He asked for peace earlier. I declined it. Fair dues. I offer him, I extend the olive branch this time, he refuses, that's his own mistake. We are at war on two fronts with the Rodox, but I think we can do a bit more damage to the Nords, hopefully force him into uh, offer us a peace agreement. We'll take Kundar Castle next, hopefully this one, depending on how many defenders there are, we'll push to the, what is it, we'll push north, take Albert Castle, Bulga Castle. That will just leave the Cura city and Wurcheg city. And then, with any luck, depending on how many, how str strongly defended it is, we'll try and take Wurcheg. That'll give us a nice positioning there. But anyway, that'll have to wait until next time. I hope you've enjoyed this. Thank you for watching. Enjoy me next time.